We all know that bread is a staple of the Western diet. Yes, and most restaurants always keep it stocked on the dining table, while many households serve it with every meal. Did you know that bread supplies about 20% of the total food calories worldwide? Yes, and there's nothing wrong with eating homemade bread every once in a while. But, the experts say, that processed bread really shouldn't be eaten every day. Here's what will happen to your health when you stop eating bread. You lose water weight. When you reduce your carb intake, the first thing you notice is how quickly, even magically, the weight falls off. But it's not fat you're losing. It's water. The experts say that when carbs are stored in the body in the form of glycogen, each gram of carbohydrate stores three to four times its weight in water. Well, this means that when you cut carbs and start using your glycogen stores, you'll lose a good amount of water weight. You will feel exhausted. First, you should know that carbs are the brain's main source of energy. And the experts say that when a person cuts down on carbs, the brain is running on fumes, especially as glycogen stores get low, and become depleted. Eventually, once all that glycogen is gone, your body breaks down fat and runs off of little carbon fragments called ketones. The possible side effects, bad breath, dry mouth, tiredness, weakness, dizziness, insomnia, nausea, and brain fog. Basically, you feel like you have the flu. Eventually, your body adapts to running on ketones so you don't feel so bad, but they are not your body's preferred fuel source. Digestion Problems A recent study has discovered that a whole grain intake is a major player in how much fiber you get. This study has found that 92% of US adults don't get enough of the grains. Fiber, the indigestible part of plants, like grains, not only helps stabilize blood sugar levels, reduce the risk of obesity, and chronic diseases, but keeps your bathroom habits regular. Anxiety. And not just because you're eating all of your sandwiches as lettuce wraps. Carbs, whether they are whole or refined, increase the brain's levels of the feel-good neurotransmitter serotonin. So when you cut healthy carbs like whole grains, your mental health goes right along with it. Carbohydrates are the body's primary source of energy for fueling all exercise, including both endurance and resistance training. Well, this means one thing, if you cut on carbs, your energy will drop. Decrease your levels of your body's stored carbohydrates, and your ability to produce force and power will decrease. 